you're probably hearing how important it is to be producing content for your niche market. But how do you constantly come up with new ideas and topics to talk about consistently every single time? More importantly, how do you stand out in this noisy world called social media? Especially when more and more people every day are producing content and fighting for attention. <sighs> My name is Trey Bear, and today I'm going to teach you how to instantly find endless content for you to talk about inside your videos and grab your ideal customer's attention fast over everybody else. Let's get started. All right, so before we get started, I want to let you know that we have a challenge coming up for entrepreneurs, influencers, go-getters, online business owners who are looking to drive leads, get sales, and bring awareness to their business on autopilot only by doing the work one time while still getting paid years and years down the road. It's called the VML Challenge, and you can find more information about this challenge in the description section below this video. And hey, while you're down there, be sure to like, comment, and subscribe as I put out a new video each week to help badasses like you crush it in their business online. So first off, people are pounding their heads against the wall trying to come up with the next best piece of content to be putting out there for their audience to be consuming like crazy. And so rather than trying to come up with these new ideas on, by yourself, why not just go out there and look and see what the people are asking? For example, if you already know who your target market is, plus size women, yoga lovers, dog owners, then use these simple tools to find content ideas and see what your target market is asking. So the first tool that I use is what's called answerthepublic.com. You can type in the keyword that you want to target based Based on your niche market. So let's use bodybuilders. On the next page, all the questions being asked about bodybuilding will show up. What do bodybuilders eat? How bodybuilders cut? And if you scroll down even more, you get even more ideas. Can bodybuilders do keto, bodybuilding, and cardio, and even more topics below that. And so if bodybuilders are your niche market that you want to pull towards you, Answer the Public is full of questions that you can start building content around. Another great tool that I use to find and create content is what's called Uber Suggest. Again, just type in the keywords that you want to do some research on. Let's, this time, let's say skincare. And voila, what I want to look for are the estimated visits, the backlinks, and how many social shares there are. And this information is going to be telling me that this blog post is getting a ton of traffic to it. So again, read the blog, grab those tips from that blog, and then recreate your own version of it. And you can see what the major keywords that they are targeting, which is super helpful for video content creation strategy, for videos on YouTube, or even finding social media content ideas for blogs. And now the third tool that I use on how to find ideas for content is what's called Quora.com. Again, type in the keyword. This time, let's say it's network marketing. And what you can do is you can see what questions are being asked around this industry. You can even segment the questions to what's being asked in the last week. So two things here. You know what questions people are asking, so now you have thousands of content topic ideas, but you can also answer these questions directly while providing a link to follow you on social media if they have more questions. That's pretty cool, right? And you can probably see how easy it is now to come up with content for social media. Isn't this great? Now the next tools that I use to find content ideas is simply YouTube or Google. Have you ever noticed how that when you type something into the search engine, that Google will try to finish your sentence for you that's because they assume that that's what you're search searching for based on what's mostly being asked so let's type in makeup for older women beginners or for hooded eyes let's just use makeup for beginners okay so look at all the content from blogs YouTube videos and podcasts that you can take some time to just learn and then reteach it all in your own way. And look, another tool that I use to find content ideas is what's called Keywords Everywhere. Look over here on the side. I Makeup for Beginners is getting 1,600 searches per month. Makeup for Beginners Essentials is getting 1,300 a month. Makeup for Beginners List, 1,300. How to apply makeup for beginners video, 880. People are literally looking for a video on how to apply makeup as a beginner or makeup for beginners kit. Everyday makeup tutorial for beginners, 720 views per month. I mean, could you imagine if your content was getting 700, 800, 1,600 views per month every month? And look, not just any views, but the right views, targeted views. So there you go, my friend. So quick recap. 
The tools that I use to instantly find thousands of content ideas are Answer the Public, Uber Suggest, Quora.com, search engines like YouTube and Google, as well as that awesome Chrome extension called Keywords Everywhere. And remember, if you are an entrepreneur or an online business owner who's looking to get leads, sales, and more awareness of your business, and you want to do the work once, but you're still getting paid years and years down the road, I highly recommend joining our next video challenge by going to the description section below this video. And don't you forget to like this video, comment below, and even ask any questions that you may have or any, any topics that you'd like me to go over in the next video. And of course, subscribe as I put out new videos just like this to help you crush it in your online business. I will see you in the next video. Peace.